Guys, well, sorry for the little bit longer of an intro. Okay, we're doing this. Okay, we have the microphone on. It's working right now. Okay, well, it's July, so I'm doing a video. Okay, Happy New Year. E-year, I'm doing a video. I'm doing a video right now. You're sorry, I'm doing some Madden 20 a day right now. So basically, yeah. That was flawless, right? <laughs> that was only right, flawless. I'll, I'll say flawless. You can pick whatever you want. Um, I pick the same team. You want to pick somebody better? The best team. Do what you want. I'm taking the Broncos. I want to. I want to pick Tampa Bay Buccaneers. The, the Buccaneers are, are. Okay, I'll just switch another team. So if you want to pick, pick them, but try to pick somebody higher up than the Broncos. The Broncos. Eighty-one. Yeah, eighty-one. Let's do Steelers. Okay. All right. All right. So, um, pro. I'm gonna do that as. Now, advanced settings, receive, and now edit uniforms, guys! <laughs> what? What color are you picking? I'm black. doing the MLA, um, yeah, black. Pick something that's not gonna blend in. Oh, orange? Yeah. Let's see if it's ready. I think when you hit X, it saves it. Mm -hmm. Just do that as exhibition. Uh, uh, we'll leave that on uh, arcade because yeah, be, be, okay, because yeah. because this mountain's better. Mm -hmm. Six minutes and that and that's off. Um, Steelers. Um, yeah, well, Wembley actually. I want Wembley Stadium. Yeah, 1 p.m. Uh, just leave it. Uh, uh, just leave it like that. <laughs> It doesn't even have a picture for this, so it's just pitch black. Yeah. It's giving me as slow as the PS4 because because the PS5 is slow. Yeah, it's giving me the same loading time. My PS5 would have booted up by now. We're playing 24 next time. Yes. Next game, 24. Uh-huh, I, I understand I'll do that. our game. Alright. I'm just gonna skip Welcome that. In, everybody. It's the this is Madden 20. Okay, we're gonna watch. Stay we're stay not gonna watch the same thing. Three hundred miles away from you there in Orlando, as we come to you from the European home of the NFL, London, England. Coming up, another edition of the NFL International Series, and it should be a good one between the Pittsburgh Steelers and the Denver Broncos. So here are the Steelers now to take over for the first time. They're led They're onto the field by a man who needs no introduction, Ben Roethlisberger. An absolute yes. prototype for what you draw as a big, big, strong quarterback that has to stay in the pocket and make big throws with people all around him and even hanging on it and still has that type of strength to get the ball downfield. Ben Roethlisberger, an absolute rock in the pocket, but he also can escape and make big throws. Guys, do you agree that Madden 20 is the best? Walk in your answers in the comments. <laughs> If they're off, then it's YouTube's fault. Uh. Because we do not turn off the comments. It's YouTube. So no decision to turn off the comments or not. Of course. First play, backfire. Plus, we can push. From just shy of midfield, Flacco. That's complete to Jake Bunn. Yeah, he'll be out just we don't want to lose the football. The 17 yards for the Broncos there as they've got themselves a first down. Mm, it's like a fool my guys. <laughs> <laughs> he got the football back. But it is a loss on the play. Almost like it's almost like baseball. Guys at bat, people are on base in scoring position. One guy doesn't get them home, the next guy comes through and picks him up. And avoids the turnover. 
And he's going to have the hook up to Sutton. And he gets this one inside the 15, just a yard or two. Why? Sorry for not doing the newer Madden's play. I like this one best. We'll definitely do the the, 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 the newest one next time, guys. Yes, definitely. Even though the EA could be pasted in. And he'll be dropped at about the 11 after EA. Make something yeah, different, straight for, for change. Make the commentators the different. The Make new commentary the lines. Side something, side EA. Instead of cover, just copying or pasting whatever it was, the last minute. commentators. We're here to see this man shooting shooters. As his guys are able to strike first here in this open the and his commentators Is that disgusting? Seven years with these commentators. We take the result touchdown. Extra point from McManus is good. And that makes the score seven nothing. These are probably added in since Man 17 told so like those commentary lines that you just heard. Probably, or maybe at least man in the I'll see about that. <laughs> okay, so freaking copying and pasting. Makes something different for a change, right? How do you rebound from here? Yeah, a little bit of humor. Gotta laugh that one off and not the hot oh. one. was very funny, but kind of like, yes! can you believe that just I want the AI to catch it because I don't trust the player. Very strong gain of 24. Fucking yes, it's a fine one. Fucking yes, it's a fine one. Fucking yes, it's a fine one. AI does its job. That speed. And now they're acting like wide receivers. Yeah, tight end one handed catches. They're kind of like wide receiver one handed catches nowadays. Just yeah, I, didn't, right. I didn't lose the football there. First down, but this throw down field incomplete. Yep, they said incomplete. Yeah. Starters, here they are. David DeCastro, what do you think about him, Charles? Let's see how close that was. There is one foot in. Oh, oh, it's barely out of bounds. Could not have been better trained at Stanford. So well schooled in the run game and the pass game, and especially in pro principles. David DeCastro could be an all pro in the years to come. On second and ten, Roethlisberger. Incomplete. Good protection. Wow, it went off. Good hook up by. Now it's third down. And a look now at how the Broncos line up defensively. Von Miller is so good that he doesn't even need a nickname. His ability to bend and dip on the pass rush, unequaled in this league. In 921, they removed that cutscene. But the first crap they take away, right? But two incompletion sets. To throw here, Roethlisberger. Damn! Yes! Oh my god! Is it good? Is it capable? Oh my god. A place like this where the ball comes free is even unusual for the team that lost it to get it Why? back. Why? Because this is, this is a quarterback. The ball gets away from him. Everyone else is trying to execute what they're supposed to do on offense. They're usually looking in the other oh, direction it. downfield. You almost caught it with your foot. <laughs> Sometimes I see the ball through his hand and still catch it. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. I enjoy the horse racing, right? Looks like they call a flyer out of the gate, as they would say when you run in the big time races. It means they get out to a fast start. They're setting the pace, making the other team chase them. Solid run on first down, gain of seven, leads it with a second and three. We have four commentators in the game, right? On second down, the run with Lindsay. Nine yards to pick up there, and it's a first down. One time on getting the sense Charles are gonna After second down, they said um and I'll leave a second down and I was like What? It's third down and they said Oh it's wait no, it's third down. I can't believe they end that commentary. Alright, ready. I am ready. Here's Flacco on the play fake to Lindsay. 
He's got Jake Bud as tight end. Look at this. Big gain, but a fumble. But this will get out of bounds, so possession will stay the same. That's my winner. He's even on a fumble, so at least it's fun. No longer bounce. It would have been at least picked up by me. This is something. I know it's coach is just hang on to the ball, man. He gains the gain on that last run. Here's second and a couple. Flacco on the give to Lindsay. Yes! And he loses the football the second time. And it looks like <laughs> second time he fumbled. fumbled. The psychology of the game never ceases to amaze me because you would think there would never be a fumble from what we hear from coaches all the time, right? And how much they practice not fumbling. Practice it, preach it, talk about it all the time. You would think no one would ever turn it over. Oh, I thought they were humans out there running around, and we just saw another one. Opportunistic by the defense. After the incompletion, I thought that was a fumble, too. I thought it was going to be a fumble. Again, another touchdown. One time was an offensive touchdown. One time was defensive. I was giving a special team touchdown. Or a coach. So they throw the pick six to get another shot at it now as this one's in the air. Four million chair. That is sunny. He's got to figure things out. He's completed three passes, but two of them have been to the wrong team so far. And when we talk about the best quarterbacks, we're usually talking about touchdown to interception ratio, aren't we? And two to one is acceptable, but the top line guys, three to one, are better. Is what they're looking for. Now we're talking about interception <laughs> ratio. Should never be in any discussion. A complete pass leads to second and ten from the twenty-five. Now Roethlisberger. Yes. That's particular. Touchdown. 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 Pittsburgh. I James Washington. You see, I went to the invisible barrier. I thought I was gonna actually choose fake because that sometimes happens. It's not pretty. Oh God. I think I missed it. And his kick is no good. It's an early miss. We'll see if that has any ramifications later here as the afternoon wears on. Peace. Right now, on the branch, we my eight. So, with the miss PAT in his rear view mirror, he goes back out to kick this one off. Rookie mistake. Rookie mistake. <laughs> And he'll be brought down to the 23, make it the 24-yard line. Broncos on the field, ready to start their next drive. Now, last drive, obviously not what you're looking for. You've got the lead. you got to... And, oh, my goodness, he loses it again. I will, you lost it again. It no. Two fumbles, but I recover. Sometimes it acts like 21, but sometimes it's good, but most of the time, it acts like they're regular to me. Yes! Another touchdown. That was spectacular right there. Spectacular catch. I thought that was going to be like an interception. I'm trying this again. I hope I don't freaking miss it. Yeah! I made it. Now I'm down by only one. Yep, one point game. One freaking point. Freaking. That was a nice fair catch all. The Broncos are in the field ready to start their next drive. And they had the fumble last time that led to a touchdown. 
That's a no-no. We'll see what they do here. Let's go around. A big no-no. Put that in capital. No ball security is in our case. The other team takes it down and scores. No ball security. Later for a football team. Now it's up to the offense. Even though it's the decent, there's no ball security. We'll they can pick those things. Because it's always fumbling. Okay. Steal the territory now. Here's first and ten at the 47. The team wants to be smart for the game. Then the catch made. This is a man with a man. He takes this just a few yards shy of the red zone before going out. That's back to back plays of over 20 yards. Of course, the catch was nice, but I think this is like the second game that we played that's at. Uh, that is at Wembley. Like the Wembley Stadium. I think this is our second game. Because one time we did it in 21, and now we're doing it in 20. Uh, yeah, we did this before in Wembley. Remember that time it hit off the left upright, but it went through anyway on the field goal? Yep. Yeah. Last week, excuse me. Oh my god! Guys, do you remember that video? I'm, I'm, I'm not sure that you remember it, but I do remember it. Like, it hit off the left upright, but it went through. Nuts, guys. You're so close. Today is acting like 21. <laughs> Today. But. Oh, they're doing it. They're walking animation. Fourth fumble. I'm him. Crazy, right? <laughs> Here's Roethlisberger. He's going to launch it. And big, big this time there's Picked off by Justin Simmons. And they will be set up now. You basically got this place to work before, right? And that interception sets them up beautifully already in the red zone. And you can hear it all the way up here. Oski, Oski, everyone turn to block, find the spot. And now they're set up inside the red zone for their offense. At least he got that. And that was a first three. That was an important score. And the Broncos push further out in front. And always a good first half when you can hit Peter twice. And it never hurts. It's saying he's Peter twice. He's three times. Because he scored three times. I get some more. I get some more. And it'll be encouraging as well. It's a vibe. The crazy face. After the touchdown, here's McManus now to kick it away. That's touchback. <laughs> Only 13. Good game. You fumbled me four times. But they didn't run runs yet. Oh, that matches the fumbles. Charles, he's thrown five picks in a game before, and right now, after that one, he's standing on number four. And right now, your defense is going to be a good That just matches it. That's a turnover. And it doesn't necessarily mean eight turnovers because he picked it up so, so, so. They may have to keep things in it. But yeah, if all those official turnovers, it would have been eight. Good for 22 at a first down. Oh, I got you instantly. Oh. 
Well, a big is called a tuna. <laughs> Mommy, can you get your cheese? Can we get cheese? Tuna. I ate tuna to my chat. I know you know. I know. You don't need to know that, but it's for the better. <laughs> I guess you would want to know. I guess you would want to know. It's oh, I Able thought that was fumble the right there. If that was man 21, definitely a freaking fumble, right? So it would have been like a touchdown by now. No question about it here. Why not go with the fresh legs? Able to push forward, pick up that first. Hey. Hey. They'll try to run with lenses, and this is going to result in losing yardage. They're driven back to the yard line. A full five-yard loss that time. Do I have a bottomless pit? They don't need to run another play here before. Do I have a bottomless pit? Let's see if they do it anyway. Turns out my food from years ago is we've still falling. Oh, yeah. Right? Because <laughs> there's a bottomless pit. A reminder that when halftime rolls around, Jonathan Coachman will have all the highlights and analysis of this first half of play from our studios in Orlando. So a nice job to break the one tackle, but not much damage. One of the cameraman's legs is through that. You, 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 you know that thing was just only in the NFL? His leg is right through that. <laughs> Physics are a factor, right? <laughs> I'll show you at the end of this drive. Hey, Cameron Hayward's ability to take on blocks, hold the point of attack, and get upfield serves him very, very well. What a nice play there. Yeah, he can take on blocks because he's built like a block. Hit. <laughs> So that'll back him up five. So on fourth down, on comes Brandon McManus and the field goal unit for the Broncos. From the right hash here, should be an easy one. And McManus able to put it through. And that will extend their lead even further. That drive took him inside the 10. Good job defensively. It just played burn the house down by AJR. It just it just played burn the house down by AJR. We heard it. Wait a minute. I don't think I saw any T on that thing. I don't think I saw... What? There's no T! The T is over here instead of over here. <laughs> Oh, yeah. Yep. <laughs> Physics are oh, a factor. Was the, was the, no, it wasn't the penalty on that one, was there? No. Yeah, I don't, I, that's crazy. Yeah. It's crazy you noticed it. Nope. Um, the freaking T is over here it's instead of over there. Yep. <laughs> and also, I also have something else to show you. You go over here, right, where, where, like, like, like where one of these cameramen are. His, fit, his foot is right through that. <laughs> <laughs> Why? <laughs> Why? Broken. Yeah, broken. <laughs> uh huh. <laughs> this game is broken. Physics are factor over here. Yep. I heard that commentary line a billion times. The one that 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 that, that, that they just says. Yeah? And it was on the 21, obviously, because they just keep 
Nothing that gives him now three interceptions in the game. Well, someone's locked into what they're trying to get done in the passing game. What was the last time we had someone get three in a, in a contest? 2011, wasn't it? Kurt Coleman? Oh, yeah, that's right. With the Eagles? That's right. Then against the, with the Eagles, and I believe it's against Washington and Rex Grossman. That's correct. They'll keep it on the ground again here. And he's got Rome. And past the 40 before he's out of bounds. 17 yards for the Broncos there as they've got themselves a first down. Watch! <laughs> what? You got ripped off. That's what you get for playing arcade. Watch! <laughs> That's your arcade front Watch. right there. Boom! Right off his helmet. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh. Right off his helmet. Uh -huh. And he turns back the other way to catch it and shakes off that guy and gets in. Wow. Come on. Lucas, now, take your the extra point. Just get in the middle, isn't it? Oh, look at this. Your feet are going to try to run for him. Oh, he's too slow. Stop. Stop. But not enough to get to the goal line. You tried it? I tried it. You just punched yourself. It's your point. You missed the extra point. Stop it. Come on. Come on. Don't do it. Put that that's it. You left this motherfucker. I can understand that you want to rub it in a little. You think it when he snaps it from the three. But from the 15, mob ball that bad boy. Just as a grandmother. I'll keep going. I'll keep going. I'll keep going. I'll keep going. Yeah. All right, Brandon, thanks very much. Welcome, everybody, to our abbreviated version of the EA Sports Halftime Report. I got everything. This one is maybe not exactly in the bag yet, but there is definitely a big amount of clock in this third quarter. The team's already back out there, so let's not waste any time as we'll turn it back over to Brandon God. Where else are you pointing? I don't know where the T was. I don't know. All right, coach. Thank you. Hello. Welcome everyone back for quarter number three. Not getting a touchback. As they say here in London, all to play for as we are back underway. You need to risk yourself a fumble. This one taken from the seven. And a good return. He's across the 35 yard line, right around the 36. And here comes a big tight end as he gets set for this next drive. And we roll the highlights of the game he's had. You know, when we talk about wide receivers and how you shut them down, what about when you have a tight end like this having a game? How do you stop him defensively? It really changes what you're trying to do because defensively the you're, talking, you're worried more about the wideouts. Okay, how are we going to cover them? The running backs, how are you going to shut them down? But the tight end is that elusive, unique player. Linebacker covering, cornerback covering, safety covering him, always has the advantage, usually has final answer against anyone who tries to defend him. And he'll take this one for about four up to the four. Third quarter, you've got the lead. You're not ready to go into that four-minute offense to close the game out, but a running game can really benefit your team right now. Ah. Uh. the 40 now on second down. Flacco. The Sims has got it complete. And they're going to have themselves another first down as the tackles made at the Steelers' 40. That's flawless. They went through his lead. Did you see that? Look, they'll take Why does it do that? He's exhausted. Always remember that, guys. running play ends up going backwards as he won't get close to the line of scrimmage. In fact, he's going to lose four yards. And plays like that are exactly what this defense needs here early in the second half to give it a little spark. I think their halftime adjustments, what they talked about, maybe just a little inspirational speech. Who knows? But looks like they're ready to go. 
Throwing on second and 14. Flacco got a man open at Sutton. And he gets this one inside the 15, just a yard or two shy of the 10. That'll go as a pickup of 32 on the catch and run. Just more of the same there, partner. You guys have just been running free in the secondary this entire game. No pass rush, a lot of passes completed. Been an easy day for him. And able to break one tackle, but then quickly brought down. Five yards on the carry. Good pickup on first down. Second and five now. Flacco, screen pass to Lindsey. And he'll take it into the end zone for a Denver score. You can't believe what they have these things from a commentator since I'm on Apple 7 too. It, 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 that's seven, five, seven years. That is ridiculous. That is ridiculous. Oh, the video just uploaded. I saw it on your phone. The video just uploaded it. Yeah. It uploaded. You know that one that I hit upload on? Yep, just it just went through. It's awesome. It was the day. Uh, it was the Redskins versus Redskins matchup. Mm -hmm. Uh it's about mommy's phone that's ready to watch. Don't drop it, mommy. Even though that works. Oh. They were down at the half. Now, as you mentioned, they're down a little bit bigger, but no time for discouragement. Just got to get back to it, right? Put your shoulder against the boulder and start pushing and try and get back to where you were to start the half. Turn up the volume. Oops. Second and ten. It's Roethlisberger once more. He'll find Smith shoots. Yes. That's complete. Touch. Pass the twelve. Watch. Watch. Touchdown, Pittsburgh. Yep. Juju Smith shoots. Back up. Seventy-five yards. What? Was? Was what? Wow. Sit there and get back up. Uh, <laughs> well, it's not going to show on here, obviously, but... Yep, the camera in. <laughs> yeah. They're telling me to go for two. Mel Mike Tomlin says, let's go ahead and go for two. Now, Roethlisberger... Of course! Why are they telling me to go for two? That was ridiculous. Boswell now to kick it away after the touchdown. That's a big one, right? This will be fielded at the eight. Was that those two guys? Without those two guys, then it, it would have been a touchdown. Why is the kid facing like that? Also, oh, the kids are so like, The freaking kid are just went crazy. It's it's broken. Go ahead and give him the hat trick. He's been game is broken. Three times. You, you toss your fedora first, okay? You go ahead and do that. But let's be honest about it. That third one. That's the most spectacular run he's had in the game. It's almost as if he's been playing his own game of can I top this? And each run has been more spectacular than the last. Oh, you're about to run it out. Now McManus. Take your shot. With two seconds. <laughs> and he's 
He's been a busy man. Five for five now as he knocks another one through to extend the lead. It only took him two plays there to find the end zone. The last one, the long run, getting him in for six points. After the touchdown, here's McManus now to kick it away. They're actually not. Mm -hmm. Am I screwed? Pittsburgh's offense now heading back out onto the field. They got to dig down deep. I mean, they need something right now. Really, anything to cling on to. This offense has struggled. Partner, join me in a walk to their locker room at the half. Okay. Yes. I think what we would have seen is an offensive coordinator and his and his assistant coaches getting together all their positions, then coming together as a group, going over adjustments, and then head coach coming in and just screaming, "Wake up!" Let's get moving, guys. I'm kind of glad we were. In there that time, actually. I mean, you think you might have turned it on us, too? Yeah. And my goodness, another interception. Picked off by Justin Simmons. What a nightmarish game he's having now. Six interceptions that he has thrown. Absolutely unbelievable, isn't it? Hard to believe we're watching this and have seen it. But it just tells you about the game of football. They give it and it takes it away. Yeah, the guys, though, that have thrown six interceptions in a game, the likes of Peyton Manning, Brett Favre, I think Joe Namath, he did it three times. It'll be a pickup of 16 and a Bronco first down. Throwing here on first down. Flacco. He completes this to Sutton. And he's going to be out of bounds right at midfield. That'll line up a gain of 27 on the catch and run. It's a nice completion and a little bit of run after catch as well to create the yardage that they got. But it is so tough to cover that route, the drag route, because they run it at varying speeds. Because the key is to create hesitancy on the defender's ball. You're always so pathetic for those DBs, aren't you? They're going to snuff this play out behind the line. We have not seen that much today. The run defense, they have been porous at times today, but not that last go around. No, they really tightened it up, didn't they? They finally got themselves a win because all game long we've seen them get gashed. This time they played the responsibilities, played their keys, and made a nice stop. Wait, wait. That's trash. That's trash. 36, 36. Check 24, check 24. I think this game is done with. Unless something crazy happens, right? Play clock down to three, and we're going to get a timeout here. It's just their first, so two remaining not ready. as they burn one here in this third quarter. Computer's trying. They'll go again with Lindsay. Finds a seam inside the foot, and down right around the 37. It'll be a pickup of 16 and a Bronco first down. They're trying to show that they can run the ball and protect this lead. Give it to the pass, play a little bit of keep away, don't you think? And that's probably a good philosophy at this point, going to make that defense stand up and stop them. Mike 55, Mike 55. Here we go, D. All day, defense, all day, all day. Let's go. And that is going to do it. For this third quarter of action, you are watching the NFL on EA Sports. It's done. Yeah, the ball is the 37 on first and 10. A touchdown is fun. It's still a good game. This is going out for it. Here's a give to Lindsey running right. And he'll go out of bounds inside the 15-yard line. 23 yards on the pickup there and a first. Do my eyes deceive me or is he getting strong? Of course, against the line. It seems just as good here in the as it was way back in the first. She completed it. I do believe someone put a lot of time in in the offseason and continues to continue during the season in order to continue to carry the ball at this rate. Sometimes my third down doesn't work. Another Remember how I always say that usually on third down it's obviously good? <laughs> Every time, basically. Because it's my last hope. Right? <laughs> Before I have to punt. <laughs> oh! Yes! I got the ball! Oh, I got the ball back. Turnover there, 
You knew that was happening? You knew that was happening? Often we hear about the red zone, right? From the 20-yard line going in, that scoring zone, getting points on the board. A lot of teams call from the 10-yard line in the green zone. That's your money zone. He fumbles the ball inside the money zone. You have one job, take care of the ball. That didn't happen. Now this pass to Vance McDonald complete. And this one will be taken up. They'll spot it right at the seven. Oh, fuck you. Yeah, that one was relatively easy to see. I noticed that from up here. Yeah, it doesn't take a whole lot, does it? Sometimes you get a person talking to you. What I always love on these offsides is when each side points at the other. Hey, you did it. No, you did it. They deciphered that one correctly. Sliding out of the pocket. And now here's another interception. Picked off by Kareem Jackson. It's done. Touchdown. Dang, it's done. Dang, it's done. Defensively, they had their way in this one. That pick six makes that scoreboard even more lopsided. I remember talking with a guy in the it's league. It's already lopsided. What do you do when the game's like this? You know, it's pretty much over. You ready to go to the bench and hang out? He said, oh, heck no. I want to stay on the field. I might get some stats. I might get a pick or two. <laughs> you like being out there at the end of these wide margins. When they have to throw it, that gives you more opportunities to go get it. So they'll get another shot on offense following that pick six. And now the kick is away. This is taking about seven yards deep. You never know, I might get a couple extra yards. And he'll take it up past the I did. <laughs> to the One extra yard. <laughs> and Pittsburgh getting set to take the field. They're sort of seeing themselves spiral out of control. Let's see if they can get things back on track. I'm not going to be able to. The commentators. And my goodness, another interception. <laughs> Picked off by Justin Simmons. Yeah, I, ju I just can't do it anymore. I can't win. He just set a record that nobody ever wants to set. And that's the most picks ever in an NFL game. Eight. 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 Are we sure he knows what color jerseys his team's wearing in this one? Jeez, I don't know. It has not been good. On second down now, it's Lindsay. And not much room to operate as he'll get this up only to about the 41. Two runs in a row, but only two yards to show for it. The Broncos on third down, just one for three thus far. This is third and seven. Operating out of the gun, Flacco. This one complete to the running back, Lindsey. Yeah, he is out of bounds, but not before he's inside the 30. It'll go as an impressive not the same pass. Game. Boy, another big play late here for an offense. Charles that certainly has had its fair share of big plays. Coverage has been a problem all game long. And I would say that going along with that has been kind and he is into the end it's zone going. for the Denver touchdown. Fourth rushing touch. Philip Lindsay, 28 I didn't get a As his guys continue to pour it on. And that rushing touchdown is fourth. Puts him just one shy of the NFL record in a single game. It's time. We would love to get to that record and even beyond it. But he doesn't need to in order to impress in this one, does he? What a, what a performance. What an absolute great game. I've heard this before. Here in this one. A drive there of just four plays. And it was capped off by a Philip Lindsay touchdown run. He always win. That's all. That was all the end zone. They might want to mix something up defensively because he's been shredding them a bit, hasn't he? That he has, is, even with all the changes that you know are going on on the defensive side of the ball, he's still finding ways oh. to get open, finding the right spots, and the delivery is pretty good. Too. Nice. Over 100 yards, Solid has the one touchdown to this point. This defense was definitely alert to the annoying. Of the deep ball, yes. and they were more than ready for it. They've got the lead, fourth quarter. Maybe can expect more passes like that downfield. Don't get off sides or get too close. Again on second and ten, it's Roethlisberger. 
Open yes. man and completes it to Smith Schuster. It'll go as a gain of 20 for the play that started back at the 25. You know I'm going to lean towards the defender, right? You know I'm going to do that. That's a tough situation for him as I see it. But the truth of the matter is, that ball was not streaking fall out in his ass. He's going to fit this. I'll save the ball out for a more... We're doing it before we close, right? That's what they do in one of them. They want to aim me at the cross control team. Now yeah, we we'll 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 After that, we'll 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 He'll take this from the 40 up to the 45 for a gain of five. And there's a run to be happy with. Good, solid yardage. They'll take that any time you hand the ball to him back. Now Ben on third and long. He sets the fire deep. And now he has another interception. Picked up by Justin Simmons. This return is going to be halted right around the 28 yard line. And give him now four interceptions in this game. That's only the third time this has been done since he's in 2000. I think that tells you how much better teams have gotten at throwing the football. So if you go all the way back to 1960, 12 times before that, there have been guys who've gotten four interceptions or more in a game. I mean, most recently since 2000, Delta O'Neal and D'Angelo Hall. Give him 14 yards there and a Denver first down. So it's Bronco football as we get your reset here. And they have just about put this one on ice as they've got it here at first and ten. Now it's Lindsay. They find some open field here. Again? And he will get into the end zone. Yeah, it's over. It's another touchdown. This thing is ugly. Well, I'm just not sure what more we can say about him after that one. But we're certainly going to give it a try, aren't we? Because I believe we're watching greatness personified. It has not mattered all game long where they've handed him the football. He's taken it and found the end zone. He is so locked into that so-called zone, I don't think they're going to get him out of it in this one. After the touchdown, here's McManus now to kick it away. It put me on the 35. <laughs> I don't understand. And the Steelers set to take the field. I caught on the back of my Come over here. here in this one, Charles. What's Broken, the right? If you're a coach for this final drive in a lopsided game like this. Back. For a lot of coaches, be honest. <laughs> don't forget to do don't forget Put it back to the 25, idiots, right? Yes! That was barely in. Defensively, I know they have the comfortable lead here in the fourth, but they do not want to give up big plays like that. They want to finish strong. So oftentimes in this situation, you tighten up underneath in your coverage, and you bring your safeties back. And it will be intercepted and picked off by Kareem Jackson. And a big turnover there as his guys will get the football back. Well, this defensive pressure has been constant all game long. The pass rush, the coverage, they've all been excellent. And now they'll tack on an interception here as this one continues to slip just further and further out of hand. They'll run the Freeman here to begin the drive. And he's brought down at the 24 after a gain of four. Cameron Hayward in on the tackle. That's it. That's what you want. Straight ahead, positive gain. Just keep that clock ticking. Freeman again. And he was able to shed the tackle, but the reserves come in for the stop. And that's one of the reasons you like to blitz even on run downs. It confuses the blocking assignments and doesn't allow those offensive linemen to get up to the second level. On third down, here's Lindsey. And he gets this up to the 34 out of bounds there. It's a pickup of six and good enough to move the chains. Uh, 
Yeah, he's still rumbling, isn't he? Still looking fresh in this one despite the heavy workload. But you and I both know. Well conditioned, and he did tell us that he threw. And Freeman lost the football. And it's picked up by the Steelers. And they have the football that will set up shots. Is that surprise me at the end? They may have the edge on the scoreboard, but that hasn't been possible. I wanted Fox to be 100% on CD. He's got perfect quarterback rating. And I didn't mind to throw again because you know the ball blitzes aren't just designed to get to the quarterback in the pass. Sometimes you're just trying to take away every gap, every hole that might be created in the running game. And they did it to perfection and caused a fumble there. Nice. I might be able to. And all the way down to 15 before they drop it. A good pick up there at 20 yards. Right after the turnover, they come out throwing. And that means it's a sudden change situation. We used to practice it on defense. Sudden change, get out there, stop the offense. But you typically run out there. I did! And he's across the end. You know, I love this. Also, it was like, we were not, I was going to be in trouble to catch it. No wonder you're going to be in trouble. You knew I was going to be in trouble. I didn't see it. I did like it. I saw it as you were doing that. Fuck. I wanted to make sure it was good accuracy <laughs> before Oswald I kicked it. With the extra point. Yeah. As they make the score just a slight bit more respectable here in the final quarter of play. They have the short field and they made the quick work of it. Just two plays to get into the end zone. Boswell now oh, kicking it. away yeah. after the touchdown. <laughs> this will be taken short. They're going to start this drive in pretty good shape as they get it up past the 30. The Broncos on the field ready to start their next drive. And this game comfortably in hand. The scoreboard speaks for itself. You still got your starting quarterback out there. When you got the backup, let him get some time. And that's one of the great questions in the NFL, ah, because I'm just going to tell you, in the 2015 season, I commented on three games in a row. Let's take a job. And in none of them did the starting quarterback ever come out of the game like, for the team to have a lead. And in each instance, I asked the coaches later on, why didn't you do that? And they all looked at me and said, just don't really do that in the NFL. We, we, you know, these guys play, and we just play 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 play. Now, in certain situations, they, they will take them out. That's why I didn't want to spell them. They're not as worried and concerned about getting them out of the game. And that's always puzzled me a little bit. So, so that'll do it for us, us for my partner. Get everything to it. So that's God's say you are a Look at the Redding rushing yards. We've been watching the NFL right here, right here on EA Sports. Here's the game you have a charge for play. With that, we, we say, say cheerio. Here's the game you have a charge for play. Uh, check uh, the player stats. Yeah. Yep. Perfect. Completion, it, the, the attempts are 13, completion is 14. Let's see, let's see what mine is. Boy. Oh, 8 and 24. Miami, Ohio. 10 interceptions. 10 interceptions. Jesus. You have more interceptions than completions. Oh. Uh, disgusting. This guy. There's the Emma that's the score that's all this is ridiculous. Rushing yards, yeah. Uh huh. What the hell are the KR yards? Oh, kick returns. Alright, guys, um, I'll see you guys next time. P. Yeah, yes! <laughs> Alright, it's the end of it. Alright, yes. Peace.